Hi, this is Frank Cox, SmokerBuilder.com. Uh, today's video tip is about how to clean up a piece of metal after you've cut it with a cutting torch or a plasma cutter. You'll notice that there will be a buildup of some stuff we call dross. Um, some people call it slag. But what it is is whenever you're cutting, the molten metal's going down below and uh, down below your cut, sparks and molten metal. <clears throat> and that causes a, uh, a buildup of uh, a rough looking substance and that's what this looks like right here um, it's just this rough material this particular time I think one of the reasons I had such a bad build up was because my tip was getting bad but this is a good example of a piece that needs a lot of cleanup and so normally you know somebody would just grab a uh, somebody would just grab a, a cutting wheel I'll give you another view of that side right there if you can see it uh, right in here but uh, a lot of times what somebody would do is grab a uh, a grinder and they would just grind this off and you're just burning up a grinder wheel is all you're doing. So I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to remove that. There are tools called deburring tools and stuff like that. Um, but I use this right here. I should have had it ready. I just use a ball peen hammer or some kind of a steel hammer of some kind. And it's all you got to do is take that hammer right there and just hit kind of on the edge like that and uh, it'll just bust off and so uh, it's pretty loud in this camera probably but you just sorry if that was too loud but uh, you just beat right on the edge of the plate and then what you're left with is a, uh, a pretty smooth it's still got kind of a burr there that you can just knock down real quick with a flap disc. And that's what I use when I'm doing it. So uh, I hope you hope these videos are helping people. Um, the, we'd like to do one every day if we can. Uh, we've done several now. And uh, when I do them, I'm holding my phone. It's just like something I'm when I'm in the middle of doing something and I notice, hey, man, I bet somebody needs to know about that. And I just grab my phone real quick and I shoot a video about it. And uh, so, you know, they're not awesome video productions or nothing but they're very to the point and uh, hopefully they help you become a better fabricator um, if you find yourself out in your shop doing something or uh, you'd like to share a video maybe a tip maybe clarify something I've missed or uh, uh, develop a point that I'm trying to make feel free to do that uh, if you've got a YouTube channel share that with me and I'll do what I can to get that video out on our page um, you can now find these tips all in one place on our website, smokerbuilder.com. There's a tab called Smoker Builder University. And uh, just click on that tab and you'll see all of our videos there. Um, anyway, thanks a lot. Check out smokerbuilder.com and go to our forums. Uh, we'd like to have you on our site. Thanks.